Prologue. A Chance Encounter. The continent of Fodlan, said to be protected by a goddess, has existed for uncountable ages. Now, three ruling powers control the land. To the south is a region held for more than a thousand years by the Adrestian Empire. To the north is the Holy Kingdom of Fargus, ruled by the royal family and its knights. And to the east, a league of nobles that bends no knee rules the Leicester Alliance. Though once consumed in war, these three powers now exist in relative harmony. Nestled between them is Garag Mach Monastery, seat of the Church of Saros, the land's widely practiced faith and a power that helps to maintain peace across the continent. Not far from the monastery, at the northern edge of the empire, is a small village called Ramire, and west of this place stretches a forest where a lone mercenary awaits. Hey, wake up! Ugh, how many times must we do this? Get up already! Huh? That's weird. I could have sworn I heard someone calling me. It's still dark out, though. Hello? Yes, I was calling you. Many times, I might add. Come on, I told you not to sneak up on me like that. As if I have a choice. Do you know how many times you would have died by now if not for me? I'll tell you. 22. The three times you leapt off a cliff to quote unquote get tougher saved you. Those five mad attempts to dispatch a horde of monsters by yourself saved you. And tonight, despite my repeated warnings, you took the wrong path and ended up having to sleep on a bed of leaves in the middle of the woods. <sighs> Ignoring me, hmm? I'll take that to mean I touched a nerve. At any rate, we all make a few mistakes along the way. And by we, I mean you. And by a few, I mean far, far more than average. Now then, with that out of the way, would you like to know why I've roused you from your mud-caked slumber? Actually, it's probably easier to show rather than tell at this point. Look over there, if you would. Hmm? Stop plowing ahead, Claude. You're going to get us lost. Lost, schmast. We've got it on Imperial authority that this is the way to the village. <sighs> True, I said there was a village, but how could anyone know where it is in the thick of these mountains? I can't even say for certain where we are in all this gloom. Okay, new plan. I'll rely on my keen senses to navigate. Lucky for you, they're sharp as an arrow. Pull, both of you. Someone's here. Another bandit, perhaps? They're mistaking you for some common backwater thief. What cheek. Well, hold on there. I'm no bandit. I'm a mercenary. Well, that makes everything better. A bandit would be far less out of place in these woods than a sellsword. What brings you here? We've no time for an interrogation. Our pursuers are closing in. I don't know who you people are or what you want, but I think introductions can wait. You clearly need every blade you can find, and my pockets have been feeling awfully light lately. What do you say?
Well, since you're here, do you mind stepping in and helping us chase off these scary bandits? Don't worry about payment. You'll receive plenty of coin if we survive. Deal with things here. Watch this. Let me show you a trick for dealing with heavily defended enemies. Yeah, right. Still in the fight. Yeah, right. And that's how it's done. Don't overstep, Edelgard. My turn has arrived. Take 
I've awaited this moment. I won't allow anyone to stop me. You're making me feel bad for the enemy to be Apologies, but it was you or me. Just who are these people anyway? All three of them have crests. What's wrong with you? They're just a bunch of brats. Stop embarrassing yourself and stand your ground already! Is it quad time? I think it's quad time. No problem. I... strategy, but I'm not really used to being on the front lines. You have a thing for bleeding, Dimitri? Heal up already. Oh, your hurt. Do something about those wounds. Hey, you got lucky there. Well, lucky for me, I guess. Not so much for you. Gotta stay on guard. Bandits have a firm hold on the central road. It would be wise to move through the forest and take down the strongholds as we go. Try and keep an eye on who we're fighting and make sure we've got the right person leading the charge at the right time. Let's try this. Let's see how this goes. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best of our ability. Here I go. No mistakes. They must learn who they're up against. Take a breather. Alright, 
take it down. That takes care of that. What shoddy defenses. We'll be done before we know it if they're all like this. We'll make good use of this. That ought to unravel their defenses. Enough of this strategy nonsense! Get out there and tear them all to pieces! Okay, how many thugs does this guy have working for him anyway? The Knights of Seros are here, and we'll cut you down for terrorizing our students. This battle is practically won if the Knights have arrived. The Knights of Seros! Not now! If I don't kill at least one of them, Brat, I'm finished! Watch out! We're gonna make a last-ditch effort to rush our position. You did in the other battle. Spare no mercy for you. Never should have taken this job. Is it over?
Gotta keep aiming higher. I won't let myself stop here. <laughs> Gotta keep aiming higher. Hang on, you're seriously the Imperial Princess, the Crown Prince, and the heir to the Alliance? Yes, and as the three of us are now in your debt, I think formal introductions are in order. My name is Edelgard von Hressvelk, Princess of the Adrestian Empire. I am Dimitri Alexandra Blathed, Crown Prince of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. And I'm Claude von Regan grandson of the leader of the Leicester Alliance. Things looked grim there for a moment. Thanks to you, we put those bandits to flight. Bit of a miracle we ran into you out there, but hey, I'll take it. I've picked tougher bandits than that out of my teeth. Those guys were nothing compared to how strong I want to end up. Yeah, I can see the ambition in your eyes. Well, aren't they an unlikely trio? I wonder why those bandits were after them. Still, it's no concern of ours. We have our own plans to attend to. Now, collect your pay and be off before they get a wild idea and ask you to join them. Say, while I have you here... Do you know where I can find Ramire Village? I took a wrong turn somewhere along the way. I'm looking for a band of hardened mercenaries who follow a man named Gerald. I hear rumors that's where they're camped. Actually, Ramire might just be the village we've been looking for, too. That ring a bell, Edelgard? I don't remember hearing anything about Mercs, but... The name sounds correct, at least. Gerald's too smart to get smoked out by a bunch of rumors, but they're all I've got at the moment. In any case, we won't find our own two feet in all this dark. We should return to camp and get our bearings before... Hello there, house leaders. Hello, brave mercenary. We've mopped up what's left of those rascals, so what say we return to camp? And I insist you accompany us, good mercenary. Who, me? You heard the man. We'll wait out the night together and make for the village in the morning. It's a great plan, especially if you want to get paid, as we're a tiny bit short on pocket change at the moment. Yes, and those mercenaries you're looking for? Gerald's band, was it? They may be in Ramire village tonight, but there's no telling when they'll move on. If you come back to our camp, we have maps that may help you get one step ahead of them. This is clearly the wisest course of action. Not to mention that I would enjoy conversing with you further. 
But of course, the choice is yours. Ugh, why can't things ever be simple? All right, but just for the night. Perfect. Then might I borrow you for a moment after we reach camp? There's a matter we must speak about. Nothing alarming, I promise you. Right then. So off we go? But, um, if I may, did I hear you mention a Gerald earlier? Yes. Do you know him? He heads up a pretty elite band of mercenaries, so I imagine his name has spread all over Fodlin by now. Mercenaries, is it? No. No, it can't be him. Can it? Well, I'll just have to meet this Gerald myself. After I've seen my duties through, of course. After all, if I don't finish my assigned tasks, I'm mission the point. Get it? Missing? Mission? Come now, this is good stuff! <laughs> That's our Aloise. Come on, let's get moving before he really gets going. <laughs>